Hello, everyone. I'm the Modern Sea Witch. And I decided to switch up what boxes I'm receiving this month. So since I am really liking uh, what I've seen from uh, uh, the Witch's Moon with their Witch's Roots uh, subscription box, I decided to check out uh, their next box in their uh, three box lineup. So this one is their Witch's Moon box. And let me just say that I'm not affiliated with them. I did pay for the subscription. I want to say this one uh, retails for about $55. I will include that information on the screen. Okay. If you like seeing these videos, please be sure to comment below. Leave me any questions. If you'd like to see any different boxes that, uh, reviewed, please let me know in the comments below. Be sure to subscribe to the channel and hit that notification bell so that you'll know whenever I release a new video. Okay, let's see what they sent us this month. I'm really curious since I have not had one of these particular boxes before. Okay. So, um, with the rich, Witch's Roots box, uh, it's going to be a smaller quantity of items. So this one we should have a little bit more for the price point. Okay, so we have a personalized oracle reading. For me, that is going to be a tarot card, and it is the Seven of Wands. Let's see here. Oh, wow. Oh, okay. I, I got a feeling I'm going to love this box. So this box is about the secrets of the tarot. Um, I really, really like tarot. And I love reading all about it and learning more. So if this is a tarot themed box, oh, I'm just going to be ecstatic. Oh, wow. Oh, let's see what all they included for us. Oh my gosh. So we have a nice artwork page here. This one is a nice little incantation that you can read before um, uh, doing a reading with your tarot cards. Oh, nice. You can include, of course, it's beautiful to include in your Book of Shadows or your Grimoire. And they have artwork here for your Book of Shadows as well for each of the tarot suits. Oh, this is gorgeous. And it's a nice, nice little reference sheet about each and their correspondences of oh, this is going to be great to work with. Okay, let's put those down over here. Let's see what this is. Da -da. And if you've been watching any of my previous videos, you know, packaging, that, that always, you know, is a challenge for me. <laughs> oh, I got a ritual candle. So it's already been anointed and has some herbs there. We will have to check the sheet to verify what those are. Very nice sized uh, taper size beeswax candle. Okay, something for our apothecary cabinet. So sweet wood I believe that's uh, what that is I will oh cinnamon um, okay 
I gotta read it. <laughs> the font's a little difficult to read, but uh, reading the Latin, um, it's cinnamon bark. So and I can smell it through the packaging. <laughs> Ooh. So we have the Prophetess Ritual Herbal Tea. Again, I will have to check the sheet to see what all is in that. But that will be nice to have to sip on while doing a reading. Hibiscus. I really like hibiscus tea. Um, this one, of course, they don't have it marked that it's uh, food grade. So I would just use this for uh, maybe a sachet, um, anointing a candle, um, or other other um, uses for it that I, where I wouldn't be eating it. But I do have food grade uh, hibiscus that I make tea with. It makes a great iced tea in the summer. Oh, this is heavy. Oh, the Queen of Cups Sacred Salt. I will have to definitely read into that to see what type of salt this is. Let me open it up. Why not? Let's see if I can identify it. Oh, it's a very large crystal. Very large crystal salt, and there's some herbs in there. Mm, something very sweet in there. I will have to look at the sheet to confirm what it is in there. And I'm making a mess here. I know they want to keep everything from being damaged in shipment, but I always make a mess out of the packaging that they use. And okay, so it looks like we have a spray here. Ooh. Tarot Aura Spray. Okay. Give that a sniff. Okay, I can't place it, but I want to say there's something in common that those smell similar to me. Okay. We've got some incense, dark opium. Mm. That, that's lovely. Okay, we've got a crystal. Oh, that's a really nice size. Let's see what you are. Oh, wow. It's a nice, large, egg-shaped, tumbled stone. You might be snowflake obsidian. I'm not sure. No, I don't think so. These aren't really snowflake shapes. Again, I'm going to have to defer to the um, to the sheet. I am still working on learning to identify stones by sight. Okay. Oh, and last, certainly not least. Oh, this book box was about tarot, and they've included a tarot deck. So this is the Intuitive Night Goddess Tarot. Oh, and a nice bag to store the cards in. So let's see, I'm going to slide this box out of the way. I'm going to crack these open real quick. Give you all a sneak peek. You know, when I was uh, first choosing my first tarot deck I spent forever looking at images of different decks um, luckily we have that resource now go on YouTube um, 
there are all kinds of unboxing videos if you've never actually uh, worked with a deck yet uh, or don't have one. One person that I really liked watching all of her unboxing videos of decks. Uh, I will definitely uh, put the name of her channel on my description. I, I want to say it's Wicked Moonlight. Oh, look, they have. I like when they decorate the inside of the box as well. Oh my gosh, this. So the Oracle card that they gave me is actually from this same deck. It's the same artwork. I, When I get these Oracle cards, I'm always wondering, okay, well, what deck did that come from? I have no clue. Okay, so we have our little companion guide. Okay, that's a nice little guide. Not, not, not tiny like the little US guides. I'm sure it gives us a little bit better information as well. It can be very big. Uh, trying to work with some decks. Oh, wow. That's beautiful. Like I said, it took me a long time to settle on a deck. I ended up um, just working with the original artwork of the Rider weight system so that I could learn the meaning of the cards and not have artwork influencing me that wasn't the major consensus of all the views of, of the cards. Um, but now that I'm getting beyond that point, I've started looking again at new decks, um, but I haven't purchased one. So receiving one in a box like this, it, that's just, that's perfect timing. That's, that's synchronicity in the universe, I suppose. Beautiful. Okay, I'm just going to check the sheet real quick, just to verify the items that I couldn't identify earlier. The Queen of Cups Sacred Salt, that one, it's going to have in there green tea, almond, and gardenia oils. Okay, so I think it was the gardenia I was smelling. Um, and there's also lemon balm, lavender. They want you to use this in, um, in the bath as a bath salt and then we also have the, okay so it is obsidian and it's of course obsidian is going to help you to eliminate your fears and uncertainty help wash away negative negativity and chaos so it'd be great to meditate with before your reading So the ritual candle that they've provided, um, it's been enchanted and anointed with jasmine, chamomile, lavender, and almond oils, and then rolled in jasmine buds. Um, they want you to use this during your readings, again, to help bolster uh, those the uh, the energy in the room when you're completing your readings so that you can get, you can actually really connect with that deck, um, receive the message. I love tarot. I can't. <laughs> so this, this box, I, I, I'm sorry, I'm going to be a little biased. I, I like this box a lot. Um, but in general, though, I would recommend uh, the Witch's Moon. They, so far, have been a great company, providing great um, ingredients, artwork, um, and other items in their boxes um, that just really, um, they put thought behind. Be sure to follow along on my blog at modernseawitch.com. Follow me on Instagram at Modern Sea Witch for other content. And if you have any questions, Definitely leave some comments below. Let me know if you, there's anything else you'd like to see in the future, any other types of videos, any other boxes you want me to review. Have a great day. Thanks for joining me. On the modern sandwich, what? Okay, let's try that again. <laughs> okay, so, Yes.
I, I definitely, mm, nope, let's fix this. Um, I can't say <laughs> nice. Delicious as well as Okay, so I'm just going to check on the sheets here to see what those items were that we weren't, I wasn't sure. Anointed, I'm sorry. So the ritual, ritual can, let's try that again. Oh, that'd be great. Heightened awareness in your. I don't know if you're aware or not. And you never know what I'm going to end up doing on there as well. Okay. So, um, I looks like they have combined the oils of jasmine, tasty as hibiscus. Okay. So I think that's a 